Welcome to We On Podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore how coral bleaching and food loss are making fish fight unnecessarily. Marine ecologists in their research have observed that many species of fish lost food as a result of mass coral bleaching. This particularly affected the 38 species of butterfly fish. The colorfully patterned reef fish are amongst the first to be hit by the effects of bleaching primarily because they eat coral, which means their food source is directly under threat. Sally Keith, a marine ecologist at Britain's Lancaster University who spoke to AFP said that the history's worst global bleaching events in 2016 offered a perfect opportunity to study fish behavior. After returning to the same spot after a year, researchers were shocked to see the devastation of the reefs and the subsequent dearth of food for the butterfly fish. That changed the playing field of who's eating what, Keith said, putting different species of butterfly fish in increased competition for other types of coral. The most common tactic of a butterfly fish to signal to a competitor that a particular reef is theirs is by pointing its nose down and raising its spiny dorsal fins. The team observed 3,700 encounters between butterfly fish. Before the coral bleaching event, different species of butterfly fish were able to settle disputes using signaling around 28% of the time. But those numbers plummeted to 10% after the bleaching event, indicating many unnecessary fights, according to the new study in the journal Proceedings of the Royal Society B. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.